Hello everyone, welcome back on my channel Nutan Online Study. So today we are going to see how to make lesson plan and our topic would be foods and its type. This is for class 4th. You can see how we have to make it. This would be the format of our lesson plan. So here you can see previous knowledge. So for previous knowledge we have to write what we are, what students are already aware, are already aware of. So here students are already aware of like parts of plants. Okay, plant, plant, uh, parts of plants like stem, leaves, roots etc. And and here you can see specific uh, objectives you can see so we have to write whatever we want to teach to students we have to write all those things for generally what we want to teach to students we have to write all those things here right here you can see introduction part so for introduction part we can ask question tell me various parts of plants so student will answer leaves stem root branch fruit etc and after that we can ask what is the role of uh, roots then student will try to answer can a plant live without its root no they can't do you know what is aerial root it would be problematic for students how many types of roots are there it would be problematic for students so here you can see objective and pre, uh, specification to arouse the previous knowledge to check previous knowledge to check attention to link past experience with present knowledge here you can see statement of him so after that we have to announce our topic we have to say student today i am going to teach you the topic types of roots like this we have to make here you can see overall all look of our introduction part right now let's turn the page and <coughs> here you can see presentation part presentation one here you can see so we have to explain everything properly for like four to five minutes here you can see so shoot system and root system and we have to explain after that we have to ask a question related to that here you can see list of five questions sorry four question you can see here what is chlorophyll what is function of root and all this question and here is the answer that we basically expect from students here you can see all the answer right so uh, like this we have to ask question and student will give the answer here you can see blackboard work you can see show, uh, shoot system and we can also draw diagram on blackboard and here you can see teacher explain with help of chart students observing chart and for teaching it we can write like chart right like this we have to write now here you can see presentation too so for that tap root like we can explain our content like tap root we can explain and after that we have to ask a question related to that what is tap root what is fibrous root and here is the expected answer that we expect from students and here is blackboard work you can see here now this is this would be overall look of our lesson plan presentation one and presentation two here you can see now here you can see rest part of presentation two aerial roots storage roots and caution related with that like what is aerial root and what is storage root give examples and here is the answer that we uh, expect from students now here you can see so like this we have to ask a question to students after explaining our topic properly here you can see blackboard work so for that we have we, we have we can write definition of aerial roots example we can write and storage roots also we can like write all those things recapitulation so for recapitulation we can ask like five question five question is enough what is shoot system what is tap root what is fibrous root what is work of root so this question we can ask to students right here you can see answer of all the question that we have we actually expect from students so this is overall look of our lesson plan and recapitulation and presentation too so this way we have to make our lesson plan now let's turn the page and let's see the last page of our lesson plan that is application and evaluation so here you can see fill in the blanks you can see fill in the blanks one two three four so four fill in the blanks and five fill in the blanks here we can see and here home assignment so teacher gives home assignment on rolling board so this was a lesson plan for today if you like this video please do not forget to like share, and subscribe and thank you